Hi there, everybody, and a big warm welcome to you all to the San Siro Stadium. And Alan Smith has made the journey to join me, Martin Tyler. And our match today is Milan against Lazio. All eyes really on Milan. Well, there's no doubt they have got time to get their season back on track, but what we've seen so far from them, I'm not sure they can actually achieve that. Mid-table and not what they were wanting. Well, the visiting team have been really entertaining us with some great attacking football, and actually they're the top scorers in the league so far. Well, they play such an open, expansive game. It does leave them vulnerable at times, but they've just been outscoring the opposition. This is the Milan lineup. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the goalkeeper. Alessio Romagnoli plays with Leonardo Bonucci in central defence. Suso plays with Fabio Barini in the wide positions. And we'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. and their lineup for you now. Marco Parolo plays with Lucas in the middle. In attack, Chiro Immobile plays up top with Luis Alberto. Well, there have been some awkward times for Milan recently. One thing that's never, never decreased is the impact of this stadium. I know they share it, um, but it is a proper football amphitheatre. It certainly is when it's full. We don't half make a, a noise, these fans, and uh, the fact that they do share it with Inter doesn't seem to detract from the, the atmosphere they do create. Filippo Giacoletti is the referee for this game. Gets his cross in. Can he finish? And it's a penalty. Well, he's just telling off the uh, culprit, explaining to him why he's given the penalty, but he, no sign of a card here. Yeah, one or two of the opposition waving the imaginary cards, which you never like to see. He's done the job, he's the specialist. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Marco Parolo. Lucas. Fabio Borini. Lucas Biglia. In with a chance. Suso. That's the old one too. So quick, one after the other. Well, could this be? Talk about efficiency in attack. They have scored again. 
Well, let's take another look at the goal. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Marco Tarolo. Stefan Radu. Now they're looking to get forward from this position. Well, they could pose some danger now. So so. It was a real opportunity, but there might be a key moment in there from a defensive point of view. Yeah, well, they really did converge on him quickly. He didn't miss by much, but he's missed it. I know, Alan, this is one of your favourite referees, and he's done well here, hasn't he? He's come back and done the booking, having let the play go on earlier. Yeah, exactly. You've got to give the advantage to the team in possession. He did that, but he also punished the offender. Giro Immobile. Now Alessio Romagnoli. Now he's got the ball, what's he going to do with it? Lucas. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. And he's in, and an opportunity to help their chances now. Good defending. Oh, free kick awarded by the referee Marco Tarolo it's looking good this move shreds it through well that was pressure for the goalkeeper from that through ball and here the ball is now with Lazio Lucas Marco Tarolo. They've got numbers in this attack. And it look, threads it through. It's a good cross. Fine save he's made there. And he's not let the ball escape his grasp. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there, and pass goes straight to the opposition. Well, he's got support here. Well, they passed their way up into a good position here. And then just lost the concentration, lost the ball as well. And they've got to work hard to try and get it back. Attacking play from Milan. Senad Lulic. He's one of the best, Martin, at just shifting across, reading the pass. Shots on! Saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. Corner given to Milan. In from Sousa. Disappointed that that didn't lead to more. He's got his shot off now. Whoa, that's flown over the bar. Oh, the crowd were up on their feet there. It's a spectacular effort. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. On to the attack now. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. Bilia. Can't lose it here. And the tackler has been... And the referee is blown for half-time. It's 2-0 here. Well, when we looked at the lineups, we expected the visitors with their great record to be doing a bit better in this first half than we've seen. They've been very disappointing. Well, there's not too much in it, and uh, with the quality, the talent they've got, the game is not lost.
this is the start of the second half here at the San Siro. Into the attacking third, probing pass. Well, they're not out of reach yet, are they? If he'd taken this chance, they would have been right back in the game. Yeah, it wasn't a glaring miss, was it? It was a decent effort, not far away. How many more chances might they create in this game, though? Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Suso. Good forward play from them. And the goalkeeper's got to collect the ball for a goal kick. Well, he was a red card waiting to happen. You can see why the manager has brought him off after that yellow. Fabio Borini coming on strong and looking to play their way through now. Plenty of width for the team. To good vision here. Promising build-up until that challenge. Bilia. Suso. Calm piece of defending, no real pressure on him. It wasn't the best cross. Well, there's still time to hit back in this game, and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. He saw the look from the other player and saw where the, the shot's on. And that is quite a wild effort at goal, although he got good contact on the ball. Marco Tarolo. Getting forward well as a team now. So good on the ball, Nani. Can he finish? Well, he's cleared the danger. Well, that would be a throw. Well, this is interesting whether the manager is just going to switch things around a little bit. Well, suddenly they could be on the counter attack. Quick witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. This attack has got a bit of menace to it. Well, this is an opportunity. And when you concede a free kick in an area like this, you could be in serious trouble. Well, you run the risk when you go to ground like that with a slide tackle of getting into serious trouble. When you attempt to slide tackle like that, you've got to time it perfectly, and he didn't. And the goalkeeper read the direction well. They've got the ball back by that interception. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Cleared away by the defender. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Shot off! The keeper stops that. Abate. Now they're pressing in at him. Made the challenge well. well. That's where the free part of the pitch is in the wide areas, and he's got there. It's a fine stop. A full stretch from the keeper to turn that aside. Can't keep the ball at the moment. Now, here's a chance to get at the opposition. You like to see a team playing the ball forward to open up the opposition, but the defending was good there by the opponent. So now a goal kick to come.
going to be a double substitution. Marco Parolo. Little headed pass then, and a shrewd one. And we're hearing there will be three added minutes here. Suso looking for teammates in the middle. Milan have a corner. Taken by Sousa. Defended well. Crisp defending there. Offside. That's an easy decision. Kalinic. Rodriguez. There is the final whistle. Super performance here to get the victory in a very difficult match. Yeah, and I think confidence-wise, in terms of Milan in the dressing room, this is going to serve them really well. Plenty of goals they've scored. They are the highest-scoring team, but the defending's been terrible, and they're beaten. Yeah, unusual for them. They weren't really as flamboyant going forward as they have been all year. I'll be hoping that's just a blip.